get into the most recent pictures of Gunna in 2020. Cold. Hey. This is really recent. As you can see, there's a lot of growth in his hair. And he looks um, like he just dyed the whole thing, bleached the whole thing. Yeah, it looks... <laughs> oh, oh, man. Took a lot of your man. <laughs> <laughs> look, brother, calm down, look, brother. What's up, YouTube? It's the man with the plan, young ooze, aka Swaga, and I'm here with Money Boo. I'm about to do a review on uh, Gunner's drugs. All right, man, we're about to get into it. Ooh, wee. Let's see. All right, what you guys say about the first picture, man? It looks like he started off with a sponge mm -hmm. and like twisted it to the roots. Yeah, like I would say, yeah, the same thing. Like he's he started off with a sponge. I don't even think he really wanted dreads at this point, but um, you can see that he has a, a few twists in there, so he probably used like a twist brush or something. Second picture. Yep, second picture. What do you guys say about it, man? He looks like a little baby a little bit. Uh huh. And his hair is like baby dreads, small twist. Yeah, yeah, his dreads is like, he got a few blonde hair, you know, in his dreadlocks. Um, you can see the roots, the roots were very, like, bushy, and um, his dreads were really coming in. This is not the ugly stage, this is actually a little bit past the ugly stage. And it looks like, um, he's free from it. All right. In this picture, you can't really tell much of his dreads, yeah. however, it's like, he has a hoodie on and it looks really matted. It looks really messed up. Like it's like a free form type of hair right now. And his roots are like he has like a lot of new growth that needs to be retwisted. Oh. It looks like it's separated. It's not connected as Congos, but it's like it's like separated, but the roots are very big. And he has a little bit of blonde hairs. Yeah, he has like a few blondes, you know what I mean? Um, and it looked like he had, wasn't really maintaining it. Um, the freeform look is really good, and it looked like that's what he was going for at this stage. And same thing, freeform, highlights in his hair, and he was just like growing his hair. He had a nice, um, he had a nice shape up. Yeah, um, he was getting the shape up done regularly, as you can see. Uh, my advice when it comes to shape up, make sure you really know your barber. Make sure you trust him 100% because he can push your hairline back. I've seen people try to do a little five o'clock shadow with the baby hairs and the hairline goes all the way back. So just, you know, be careful with your barber. Starting off, I would say don't, don't even get your shape up starting off. Just let your hair, just let your hair grow. And then later worry about shape ups. This one it looks like more. Mm -hmm. This one it looks like more. It's longer and it looks like it's, re it's been. Re it's, it looks like it's been retwisted. Yep, yep. And the dreads are like below his ears. The it's, same thing, but, mm -hmm. the, but he, he, I think he. Re it looks like he re dyed it in this one. Yeah, it, it looks like his hair is starting to hang. Like he, it looks like he's starting to get a lot of volume, and his hair is getting longer. And um, at this point. You see, he probably had more money, as you see in his hand. So he probably was getting his hair done by a professional like loctician. I'll say when you're getting your hair done, go, what should you do? Go to one person because the other person, the other person, the first person wants to might twist it the other way, the other person might be twisted the other way. So you should stick to one um, loctician. Yeah, man, stick to one loctician. You heard? We gonna get into more recent guns. He dyed his hair dark brown or dark blonde, whatever you want to call it. But as you can see, his hair is really maintained well. The shape of his own point. His roots are Ooh. in this good section. Yeah, his roots are sectioned perfectly and um, his roots are not thin at all. Thinning roots, man, please don't play with your dreads all the time. Like that's what I did when I had dreads. I played with my dreads a lot. And um and I use the sponge a lot and my roots got really thin and brittle. 
But him, he's not really playing with his roots like that. He's growing his dreads. And um, right now he got the do-rag on because he about to get his hair done. Uh, you know what I mean? So, well, you about to get your hair done. So, yeah. What you got to say about this picture? He already says something, right? Yeah. And he looks like his dress could, uh, he could have him dressed for a long time because the roots are not thin. Everything starts at the base. Everything starts at the root. So if you want to have healthy dreads, you got to make sure your roots are thin and in good shape. All right, this is another picture, a side view. I mean, a front view of Gunna. He had a ponytail in. So with dreads, you can do a lot with it. You can put a ponytail in the back. Corals. You put a, yeah, cornrows. Just a ponytail. that twist. Yeah, you can do a lot, man. Um, and it's a great style. I say if you have the patience, you have to go through the struggle before you can see the view. So it takes time, but I encourage you guys to please get dreads. If you haven't tried getting them, just see how it looks on your lease. And Harris looks like a 4B type hair. 4B? I think he's a 4C, 4D. He, he, got, he got kinky hair. What are you? He's, he's a 4B, you know, kinky hair, you know. You see that clearly Gunna has his hair in a ponytail. You see the shape up is not forced. They're not forcing the shape up back and uh, they're keeping it like keeping their hair like nice and neat. And he looks like he's at two and a half years. Yes, yeah, two definitely. And a half years. Two and a half years look like it's growing, man, for real. Like he's he's seeing major growth at this point. A fresh new twist for Colos. You put his dreads and corners. Yes, sir. I used to have this style too. I'm gonna link, I'm gonna put it right there. You know what I mean? I had this style too, you know, in high school. He I had it soon. He gonna get it soon, you know. This is the reincarnation, you know what I mean? I did my thing, I had my dreads, you know. I retired from the game, but I'm still in the game. I'm coaching now. You know how you have coaches? I'm coaching now, I'm coaching him. Boy, if you don't He's in the game, so sit up straight. You're in the game, so I'm trying to show him the ways. You know, I'm even putting him on his channel because I want him to continue, you know what I mean? Continue the legacy, continue to grow. And uh, yeah. It's like he bleached his hair. Like I'll say, mm -hmm. do your research before bleaching because if you don't do it right, your hair could fall out. And I don't think his, uh, his roots don't look that healthy in this picture. And his roots are starting to look thinner. I'm not sure if he's doing his hair too often or what. What you think? I think he's doing it a lot and putting it in corners and bleaching it the wrong way. Over retwisting is a bad idea. Dyeing your hair wrong is a bad idea. The best way for drag, I think, is semi free forming, but don't let it get like, too ugly. Too, not, uh, yeah, don't let it get. I mean, if you want to free form, you can free form. Free forms are beautiful, you know? We gotta love our natural hair. But like, if you want to semi free form, that's the best way to not have thinning locks if you're gonna retwist it. So don't retwist it too often. Go ahead. Next pick, um, the whole thing is like bleach, mm -hmm. even the roots. The roots are not even black no more. Like, orange. It's orange. <laughs> like a little smurf. But yeah, you know, Gunner, he got his hair bleached. Um, he's really feeling himself, losing weight, you know, health as well. And uh, he's looking good in this picture. And for the last picture. His hair is like really yellow, like yellow teeth, kind of yellow. Mm hmm. And what, what's going on with his hair? He just like braided it or put, combined them so they could look, the outcome could be curly. Yeah, it's like a retwist, but they did a retwist method by combining two dreads and then put a rubber band at the bottom so that when he takes it out, it's curly like some curly fries. Yeah, so tune in. We got videos dropping every Friday. Every Friday we got a drug review dropping. Um, if you like this video, please do me a favor, hit that like, subscribe, and share. What you got to say? And tell us your New Year's resolution inside the comments below. Yeah, tell us your New Year's resolutions. Tell us what you want to see on this channel. Um, we're gonna keep pushing. This year, 2020, we gotta be perfect. We're gonna drop a video every week, every Friday, no matter how tough it gets, all right? Um, shoot the switch, never miss, grind up, swag out. Got older now, diamonds colder now. No cold shoulder now, I'm gonna hold it down. Better ask around, I don't make no sound. In some cool shit.